Independent School of Economics, LSE, to address this gathering for a minute. Dr. Gautam Chen, please. Uh, namaste. Um, first of all, Nachiket and I for Unity, you are doing a tremendous job. After about two decades, I'm seeing a very active organization achieving so much so quickly. And I think that uh, you must keep on doing this and you have our goodwill. Very brief word about Shahid Bhagat Singh. Uh, yes, I'm aware that some people describe him as a terrorist. Uh, Nelson Mandela was also called a terrorist. Now he's considered one of the greatest people of the 20th century. So this is not very important. I would only say that he, as a Shaheed, was true to the teachings of Bhagavad Gita more than any of these people because he sought to defend self-righteousness and justice. So we don't care what people call him. He is somebody truly worthy of our respect and emulation. I would only say one other thing. The history of the Sikh people and the great Gurus in whose tradition Shahid Bhagat Singh belong and that of those of us who are from the Sanatan Dharma is deeply interwoven, deeply, deeply. They are inseparable and every Hindu should be alarmed at any setback for the Sikh community. I will tell you a little story I discovered by pure chance when I was in Kanpandu last month in February. I didn't know that there is a Gurdwara inside the com compound of the Pashupati Nath temple. There are two Gurdwaras in Kathmandu and one of them is in the uh, compound next to Pashupati Nath, the holiest of the holy shrines, that is of the four shrines. What stunned me was the president of the Pashupati Nath committee, who is a friend of mine, uh, the Kathmandu MP, told me in whose name the deeds of this Gurdwara are you will never be able to guess. It is in the name of Nanak Beni. The deeds of the temple, the property deeds are in the name of Guru Nanak in Kathmandu because he had traveled there and he had done what we call Thapan. But then you will not perhaps know that Guru Nanak also traveled to Africa. He has traveled enormously in India and beyond. So the histories of these two people are inseparable. It is the basis for the defense of righteousness which many of us have forgotten that we do not accept injustice. This is a tradition which has been grievously wounded in India which is why it is a cause for grave concern that the numbers of the Sikh community are declining. Everybody should be very concerned which is why I truly welcome the announcement from Amritsar where it has been advise that Sikh mothers should have four children. This is one cure for this enormous tragedy. We will one day weep if the Sikh community shrinks in size. It is already very small. I come from Calcutta which had a vibrant and big Sikh community. Now, Calcutta did so badly on the Sikhs ran away. Calcutta is not the same without the Sikh community. And everybody will weep. So, Please, please be very concerned for these issues to do with the Sikh community. They are our issues for all us Indians. And Bhagat Singh will remain for us an icon for what it is that we need to do when we confront injustice. We do not accept. And if the system does not deliver justice, we will try to deliver justice. This is why very big injustice still needs to be addressed. Uh, what happened in Delhi in 1984? And I hope the new government will prosecute this matter with great determination because it should concern every Indian that such a heinous crime occurred with the complicity of the government of the day. Thank you. Sarfaroshi ki tamanna ab hamare dil mein hai Dekhna hai zor kitna baadwe ka dil mein hai Now uh, we would uh, like to be invited by Gorji of Intercontinental Hotel to please address this August Madhuri and uh, we presume Nachikechi is it he is also having an event on 27th I think he will talk about it Please uh, address this August Madhuri
Thank you very much to <coughs> invite me to on the stage. And uh, I would like to say a few words regarding the Pak Singh. As we know that Pak Singh was the great leader, he's a freedom fighter for India for today. We are sitting because of him. Our country is uh, independent because of those people who sacrifice life of uh, us. We should be contributing something for them, which we are not doing. Wish we are future, we want to do it. Pagat Singh, everybody know that. Pagat Singh is a sacrifice of life for us. And we wish everybody, every year, we should be celebrating the day. And other, like uh, Gamakata, Baba Kudas Singh, and other, so many other people, which is a started fight for India. So we should be celebrated. He is there. People should know who was the, who was created is the, for the freedom fight for India. India is the today and we always pray, always on our eyes, always started free for India, fight for India. Baba Gita Singh started freedom fighter from Hong Kong and he was the first Indian Punjabi who was a fight for the India, India independent. I would respect Qatar Singh Sarapa, who has sacrificed life. He is also an arise for, uh, for fighting for India. And uh, if I say, Gandhi ji also sacrificed life for India, he also an arise. I wish uh, we should be celebrating every thing for India. I would like to say everybody should uh, 